Mustafa Ahmadi Roshan. He was a nuclear scientist and university professor. He was 32 years old. He was a graduate of Sheriff University. He was a chemistry expert. He was a deputy director for commercial affairs at Natanz Uranium Enrichment Facility. He had a wife and a son. He was assassinated. Iran accuses Israel of assassinating an Iranian nuclear professor in Tehran, pointing to a string of attacks against such scientists in the country. Iran's vice president reacted to the attack by saying it would not stop progress in the country's nuclear program. The morning of January 11, 2012, a motorcyclist attached a bomb to a Peugeot 405, which exploded. Mustafa Ahmadi Roshan, the chemistry expert, was killed in a car bomb explosion, while two others were injured. The magnetic bomb attached under Mustafa Ahmadi Roshan's car went off at a faculty of Iran's Alame Tabari University. This same magnetic bomb was used to kill another three nuclear scientists. Israel believes that Iran's nuclear program is about an ambition to create a nuclear weapon. Tehran denies that its nuclear program is for anything other but peaceful purposes, unless Israel or the United States attacks Iran. Iranians believe that Israel's Mossad were behind the killings of the nuclear scientists, including Mostafa Ahmadi Roshan. Israel is using an excuse to demean Iran and prevent them from developing a nuclear program which could grant them nuclear energy. Yeah.